So the first item is, actually, before I tell you the first item, let me say that you may not agree with what I'm about to say. These items may not be things that you are ready to ditch, but at least if you watch this video, you've got awareness. And it's not a long video. That very classic, I hear you say classic, classic. Classic's always right. Actually, classic isn't. I'm talking about that V-neck, very tight sweater, pullover, jumper, whatever you call it. Yes, it's classic, but classic can look dated. And this particular item that is classic, that is very tight to the body and shows all the rumples around your tummy, is dated. It also shows, it stretches over your upper arms and shows your upper arms as well. So what are we wearing instead? A V-neck collared pullover sweater jumper because that is what is current now. It's going to be around for a couple of years in my, my opinion. It hangs slightly looser and you can wear it in the same way as you would wear the, the jumper you're, you're ditching. You would, you know, it's going to go with those same outfits but it's also, it's got that modern vibe that shows that you're up to date. It's got just up to date your look, it'll up to date your outfit. Now there are plenty of examples around and I will list some down below so you can uh, shop them as well. And they're coming in a variety of colours too. They're not just classic colours, they're coming in, you know, those lovely uh, pinks and so on as well. My next item would be joggers. And I'm talking about ones with the elasticated ankle and they've got the elasticated waist. I think they're absolutely great for at home, but they aren't for wearing out now. As your casual non-jean trouser, that's not what to wear out. But in the meantime, what I'm going to be wearing is striped wide leg trousers. And I don't mean wide like that. I don't mean huge, huge, huge wide. You know, I'm talking about a straight wide. And I don't understand it, but stripes are still here. They've been in for ages, ages, years. And they're still here. So if you've got your side striped trousers, wear them. And if they are wide leg, wear them even more. And if not, then buy some. They are so comfortable and you'll look really modern. I went out recently and I was wearing some. And there's another lady at the event I went to, around about my age, and she was wearing some as well. And she said, oh, look, we've got the same trousers. But what she was doing also was wearing, you know, a sleeveless pullover over the top and a blouse underneath. She was totally, totally on trend. So in our age group, Yes, out and about. Yes, women our age are on trend. In fact, her outfit was almost a dupe of this one, except she had a blouse as well underneath. I was very tempted to say, do you watch my channel? But no, I didn't. If you want to subscribe to my channel for more out-of-date information, in-date information and so on and how to wear them, then just scan the QR code and you can subscribe. The third item would be that classic crew neck, buttons, cardigan, that is short, comes to the waist, very similar to the first item, the v-neck jumper, it's going to be tight on you and uh, it's, it's just, it's just that, that clingy little, little classic unit, you know, it's one of those items that you will have had, you know, people would, would have bought maybe 20 years ago and said, yes, this is your, never going to date, but actually it does, you know, what we're replacing the, those cardigans now with this year is the lady jacket. And there are so many options out there. This is an example of a lady jacket. You know, it's a knit, and they, but they come, come in a sort of a tweedy material or a thicker jacket type material as well. But this one's a knit, so it's a sort of so it's a cardigan in that sense. But it's a lady jacket style in that it has epaulettes. It's got, you know, epaulets around the whatever you call these around the, there it's buttoned down here it's got sort of pockets or fake pockets on the front and it's hip hip length here so uh a waist waist length and a little bit boxy so this is what you're going to see in the shops you're also going to see the things i'm saying don't buy in the shops just because they're in the shops the retailer is saying this is fashionable no it's saying actually you you guys always buy this stuff so it's oh, i'm just going to put it in the shop because someone loves it but actually no go to the more on trend ranges within the store to find what's current and you'll find then probably that the lady jacket would be sitting in that type of range that brings me then on to jeans 
And of course, the jegging skinny jean is out. Now we are seeing slim jeans, but they're a slightly looser skinny jean. So put away your skinny jeans, your jeggings and so on, unless they're really comfortable ones that you're wearing around the house, like the Halara ones I showed you in an earlier video. You know, that's great for around the house. You know, really comfortable and stretchy and so on. But generally to go out the house, tuck your skinny jeans away, you know, put them in the attic, put them somewhere. They may come out again another day. You can't go wrong at the moment with a straight jean. You may want to avoid um, another fashion style jean, like a boot cut or a flare or whatever, until they're a lot more prominent. But at the moment, the most prominent you're going to see and feel comfortable in, I would imagine, is going to be the straight jean. And they do work well with them with uh, the knee boots because then you've got just a slight little puckering of that material above the knee boot that gives you that modern modern look. My next item, I imagine many of you haven't got, but it's these lightweight sort of jacket jackets um, that are quite tight on. They're short and they, they're not cropped. They're just a, a bit of a nothing jacket. It's more of a, they're a jacket material, very lightweight kind of material that almost feels like it's a, it's a cardigan shape. Now those aren't around at the moment. I, as, as you can see, I've got two. This one is years old and this one I bought this year. So what a mistake that was. Um, anyway, you know, it's obviously something that's got to go away now for a, a time when they're a lot, they, they come back into style because they will. And what you will see now, and I absolutely adore and are looking, I'm looking for for myself because I actually haven't got one yet. And I've seen news readers wear this as well. And this is the notch neck bralette blazer and or jacket but they're also looser so we're looking we're, we're wearing looser jackets and actually the sleeves on the jackets now aren't we aren't worrying about sleeves coming to 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 our wrist which is great for a short sleeve person short arm person like me the look currently is to have your sleeve on your jacket halfway down your hand but i do have a website i'll keep up to date with items so whenever you're watching this video click on the website here my my scan this you will go and see what's currently in the in the shops that you can shop as well as shopping this video by going underneath in the description box and then i want to give you one more bonus item of an item to buy to supplement your wardrobe and that is the sweater vest and this year it seems to be that it's more cable knit and it's more of a, a, a crew neck and it's it's thick enough to wear without a blouse underneath and as we were wearing them a couple of years ago with a white shirt underneath, that seems to be not quite the thing. It's either sleeveless or, say, a striped shirt would look really great underneath your um, cable knit or crew neck uh, sweater vest. There are a lot of options down below for you to shop to supplement your wardrobe. This is what I, I gave them six recommendations here in total, including the sweater vest. That's not a lot. You get those six and then you are, you've, you've really supplemented your wardrobe to have a modern look.